Depot today, and you can probably get you know these these um, nuts and bolts on the bolt right there, the all the screws or whatever, bolts or screws either way. It it was the same pretty much. Uh, you can get them at any hardware store. Um, but if you saw, I had um, the bolt I got, or the, the screw I got was quarter inch or one fourth of an inch uh, and 20 by one, one and one quarter. One fourth, <clears throat> and it's a machine screw um, made by Crown Bolt. And then um, I talked to the guy over at Home Depot, and he said that I also needed to get some lock washers uh, because I said that I am having a hard time with my um, with the nuts uh, falling off uh, of the bolts and. Uh, and when the nuts fall off the bolts, then or the screws, then uh, the screws fall off. Whenever my wife grabs my wheelchair and throws it in the back of the truck, um, so what I'm doing here is I'm uh, initially I just what I want to do is I want to get it stabilized and put one bolt in. I put one bolt in. Um, in the hole, uh, on, and uh, so I attach the foot plate to my wheelchair frame, and then uh, I'm using one of the washers or one of the one of the nuts. You see that that's the nut that I got. Um, you know, uh, I threaded that in, or I uh, tightened that on to the bolt um, on the bottom of my wheelchair so that uh, it would hold. So that so that one, one saw that the plate, the foot plate would hold, and this one, uh, what I'm trying to do, the other one, I'm trying to, I put the bolt through there, and then on top of the bolt, I'm putting the uh, lock washer, and I'm gonna have the, the teeth of a lock washer. I want them to point outwards, so I want them to point towards the nut. So whenever I screw the nut in, then it it kind of pushes into the teeth of the lock washer. Um, and it's it's kind of this is kind of hard to do with one hand and hold the camcorder at the same time, but uh, I was able to do it with a little bit of with a little bit of luck. So I t hand tighten those in. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to get a wrench and get a get a wrench and then uh, get a uh, Phillips screwdriver and, and tighten it in uh, even better because once you tighten it in by hand, you see how it's still loose right there. And I don't know if that's because it's it's um, stripped around the 